Sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. Good advice. But exactly how do you protect yourself against these nasty critters and stop a good night's sleep from turning into a nightmare? I flipped the bed over, two clumped together there, one there, 50 right there. She has a rash all down her arms. They're all over her body. And this couple's experience is alarmingly common according to Hania Ray, who's written about these pests for Consumer Reports. They are these creepy crawly little insects that look like this. Ooh. And they are ready to feast on your blood. What's the first thing I do when I walk into a hotel room? The first thing that you're gonna do is leave your suitcase either outside of the hotel room or put it inside the bathroom because bed bugs don't like smooth, clean, cold surfaces. They mm. want those tiny cracks and crevices yeah. that they can crawl into. So how do you search for bed bugs? Do you wanna join me on the floor? I got a little surprise for you. Mm, what are you talking about? Ah! Oh, wait a minute. This isn't real bed bugs, are they? No, they're not real bed bugs. They're actually onion seeds <laughs> okay. and poppy seeds. Right. But, you know, the onion seed size is about what you would see if you did have an adult bed bug on your bed. And these little poppy seeds are sort of like what the egg size would be. You want to search in the sheets. You want to search in the mattress. Mattresses? Yes, in the box spring, in the pillows, behind the headboard, the nightstands. You really want to make sure you've got everything covered. You can pull out your cell phone flashlight and look in all those dark cracks and crevices. Hania says to keep an eye out for dark rust-colored spots on the sheets or mattresses and to check all the upholstered furniture in the room, not just the bed. If you see any sign of bed bugs, ask for a new room in another part of the building. Just because one room has them doesn't mean the entire hotel will. So how do you get rid of them? Bed bugs are notoriously resistant to typical insect sprays. You'll need a special type of dust that sort of desiccates their skin or dries them out and kills them that way. Right. But that usually takes a, a, an exterminator and a, and a knowledge of what to look for. If I accidentally bring them home, what do I do? First, when you get home, even if you don't think that there's bed bugs in your luggage, leave it outside or put it in your garage or a place where they can't easily get into your home. Mm -hmm. Throw your clothes or your articles into a dryer, leave it on a high heat setting for 30 minutes. What does that do exactly? That'll kill them. Oh, okay. <laughs> bed bugs know no boundaries. Turning up in movie theaters, bus seats, even hitching a ride on a commercial flight. I've seen lots of my friends have their lives personally upended by this. Bed bugs can make their way into super fancy hotels, but they can also be in senior citizen centers. They really can be anywhere. You just want to make sure that if you do spot one, get an exterminator right away because it's a problem that can easily get out of control. Hania says bed bugs are much easier to control when they are caught early. So stay vigilant, monitor your home, and be careful when you travel. And that way, you could avoid something like this. Look at that. Happening to you.